Hello guys and welcome back to the crazy Minecraft video where today Mark my friendly zombie has an awesome challenge for us. He wants us to go ahead and find out what's going on inside the village. Every single week these villagers are in trouble and they always need my help. Well Mark, what's our mission for today? Hello Marie, how's it going? It'll be so awesome if today you guys can come with me to the village and we can go ahead and fix their problem together. Well, let's go and figure out what they want us to do first. So Mark our friendly zombie has given us a book and it says, Hello Naveed, I am so sorry to say, but the villagers need our help again. They have somehow broken the matrix and have duplicated their houses. Don't even ask, I have no idea how. Wait, what do you mean they've duplicated the matrix? Whatever's going on, we need to get to the bottom of this. Because these villagers are always up to no good. Whatever's going on, we must kill the villager that started all this. Well guys, let's head to the village and find out exactly what's going on. Mark, Marie, I'll meet you there at the village. Well guys, let's do this. Well, here we are at the wonderful village. Hello villagers, it seems like you guys are stuck in a little rubble. There's trees everywhere. Normally, this little village is actually not like this at all. Well, let's go and find Mark Friendly Zombie and figure out what the problem is. Excuse me, villagers. Do you know where Mark my Friendly Zombie is? Oh, perfect. Thank you. Oh, there he is. Mark, I made it to the village. Okay, what's going on? Where's the broken matrix? All I see is a whole village stuck in a forest. That's not so bad, is it? Oh, hello, villager. How's it going? It seems like he's gone ahead and given us a flint and steel an iron axe and also an iron pickaxe with a wonderful book to read. Well, let's see what it says. Hello Naveed, some inception is going on in our village. Some of the villagers are stuck down there. Go to each floor to make sure each of the lonely villagers are doing okay. Wait, what does it mean each floor? All I see is... <gasps> Wait a second! Guys, it seems like there's a whole village down there and it's pretty much continuous all the way until bedrock. Okay, we need to get to the bottom of this. And I think the most important thing is we don't die either. Well, let's get going. I think our first mission is to go ahead and find out how to get ourselves in there. Is it all made out of glass? Oh, there we go. Perfect. I'm going to have to break those and hopefully we just jump straight onto that ledge. Yes, perfect. I'm so glad we made it. But look, it seems like these villagers are preparing for a war. Their whole bunker is full of so many weapons. Do you know what? I might take a few. Perfect. <laughs> and good. I'm going to take one of each one. So I haven't got this one. I haven't got these ones. And perfect. Um, do I have this one? Nope, I definitely don't. Let me take that one as well. And also this giant minigun, which I think is super cool. Okay, let's take one of each one. And perfect. And let's do this. One of the miniguns. Oops, <laughs> it's a pistol. And there we go. Do you know what? This is awesome. Oh, and an ACR, one of my favorite guns. So there's nothing inside the furnace. Nothing else around here. I think now's the time to go ahead and jump onto the next floor. Here we go. Wait, can we stand on this? Oh, some of the floor gives way. Okay, let's do this. Down we go. And perfect. Huh, that almost killed us. Okay, let's find out what's inside these chests. Ooh, emerald outfits. Perfect. Okay. Golden apples, and good. I think we're going to need some more inventory space. This floor is full of so many wonders. We have an emerald sword, just in case we see some dangerous monsters. Also an emerald dagger. Hmm, strange. I've never seen anything like that before. And also another emerald dagger. Nope, can't get inside that one. An emerald halberd, and also an emerald broadsword. And then it keeps on going all the way around. This is absolutely crazy. Ah, emerald full leggings. Emerald boots. Is the next one a helmet? Yes, perfect. Do we have a full set now? Okay, let's put on our leggings, our chest plate, our helmet, and also our boots. Perfect. This is exactly what we needed. Now, I'm guessing we have to keep on jumping through the floors until we make it to the next one. Whew, that was so close. Nothing in there. Nothing in here. It seems like this floor is just covered with cobwebs and nothing really we can actually go ahead and use. Okay, let's keep on going. And thankfully, we haven't died yet. But... We also haven't seen any of the villagers, which is super strange. Nope, the door doesn't lead anywhere. Let's have a quick look. Okay, nope, nothing we can actually go ahead and use. Let's keep on breaking all these stuff, and hopefully we should be able to save the villagers once we find them. Okay, let's do this. I need to clear away each floor so there's no dangers for any of the villagers. Well, guys, let's do this. Let's jump to the next floor. And perfect. And let's see if there's anything down here. Oh, another chest. 
Oh! Wait, this is the ammo for these weapons! Okay, we've got ammo for this one, we've got our minigun, which is this one right here, and we've also got the ACR, and perfect. And let me just get rid of these items because I don't think we'll use it because we have a samurai sword and also some more miniguns. Well, let's reload these weapons. And perfect. Just in case we see some enemies, we might need to kill them. Also, the minigun ammo. And perfect. And let's also do the next one, which is the bison. And perfect. This is going to be a very long day. Well, let's not waste any more time and let's jump to the next floor. And perfect. And there's another chest. Every single one of these chests scare me. Oh, a ladder. We could easily use this to go ahead and climb up to the top. We could do this. Wait, the next floor is covered with TNT. Okay, down we go. And perfect. Good. <laughs> this is not going to be good, guys. Let me just go ahead and get rid of them. And perfect. And we could use them later just in case we see some dangerous stuff. There we go. And awesome. And here we go. Perfect. This is going to be such a crazy day. But thankfully, we are getting a lot of good loot. Okay, perfect. Oh, the next floor is full of diamonds. Let's do this. Wait, no! There's some sort of invisible blockade. Look, I can't even reach it. That must have been a trick. They probably want us to go ahead and fall down to the bottom. Okay, what's inside this floor? Oh, bottles of enchanting. Perfect. I could easily go ahead and use every single one of these. Well, let's see if there's anything else on this floor, like this other chest around here. That's full of... Nerf guns? <laughs> this is crazy. This is one of the strangest days I've ever had. And they also want us to go ahead and spawn these dangerous monsters. Okay, let's do this. I'm going to go ahead and figure out what we can get rid of. I, I don't need any more of those. And let's spawn a zombie soldier? Because this seems really strange. Wait, no! It's got a gun as well. Perfect. Good. <laughs> Perfect. Oh, what a crazy day. Okay, let's spawn another one. And this guy's just got a spade. Perfect. Let's hit him down to the bottom. Awesome. Okay, this is one of the weirdest days I've ever had. Perfect. And good. Okay, let's just make sure we spawn every single one and hopefully we can get rid of them. Let's use our minigun. Load. Come on. No, it's not working. Oh, here we go. Perfect. There we go. I knew it was going to work. Okay, let's keep on spawning these and hopefully we should be able to kill every single one. No. Whoa, insane! I didn't realize how strong this gun is. There we go. And perfect. Let's spawn the zombie miners. And there we go. Get ready, guys. <laughs> perfect. And there we go. Wow, this minigun is one of my favorite guns. So it seems like the next floor only has a fridge in it. So let's go and jump. There we go. And perfect. Let's see if there's anything inside. Ugh, gross! Inside the freezer, there's skeleton bones. This is absolutely disgusting. Look, look what I found inside. All of these are just full of skeletons. I don't know who's going around and putting skeletons inside freezers. Ah, oh, I wonder what they've gone ahead and killed to do that. Okay, do you know what? Let's get rid of these and let's jump down to the next floor. So, let's do this. Jump, and perfect. And can we use these? Oh, awesome! It goes ahead and heals us. This is like a savior floor. If we go ahead and right click on these, hopefully we should be able to get some more health. This is awesome. Okay, let's jump onto the next floor. And perfect. And I think... No! These are bear traps! Ah, oh, watch out! <laughs> okay, this is crazy. But I have a feeling we have to go ahead and get rid of them. Because if not, the villagers could stand on them and they could die. No! Okay, let's do this again. Mark, Marie, we've done such a good job, but we have so many crazy items. Let me go ahead and check in all the items I don't think I'll be using, and hopefully we should be able to survive this. Now, we do have some Nerf guns, which I think are super cool. There we go. <laughs> Perfect. I'm so glad it works. Mark, this is so cool. Okay, let's try another one of these guns. We have another one, which is the Nerf Pyrogun. Oh, these ones are discs. <laughs> Mark, I'm so sorry. These weapons are just well too cool. What? Okay, we've got to be so careful with these. Let's keep on throwing everything in. And perfect. And I've pretty much chucked in all the weapons I don't have a use for. No! Okay, we just died again. We fell straight to the bottom. Okay, we've got to be so careful with this. Here we go. And perfect. And we just got to keep on jumping down away from this invisible floor. Perfect. There we go. And good. I want to actually definitely fall on the floor that has those hearts. Okay, down we go. And perfect. Keep going. And good. Well, where's the floor with all the health packs? I need them so badly. Okay, let's do this. 
No! We died again! Do you know what? I'm just going to use my mini to go ahead and get rid of every single one of these bear traps. There we go. And... Ah, oh, we're fully out. Okay, let's go around here and see what happens if we throw a gun on top. Okay, nothing. Let's just shoot it. And perfect. Well, let's jump down to the next one once we go ahead and get rid of these traps. Come on! We have to get rid of the traps as soon as possible. Perfect. And awesome. And I can see some of the villagers have been trying to go ahead and make a cave system. I think they've gone ahead and tried to figure out how to escape. But I do see them down there. So let's go ahead and jump to the next floor. And perfect. And let's jump down here. Here we go. Perfect. Villagers, I'm so glad you guys are okay. I can see you're all digging away. And I think I have something that can help you guys. So what I'm going to do is give you the iron axe. Also the iron pickaxe, some bread, and also some apples. And hopefully this should actually be wonderful. Well guys, let's do this. Let's keep on jumping down and figure out what's inside the next floor. Okay, this floor is just full of redstones. I have a feeling maybe the villagers found redstone when trying to figure out how to use it. Okay, you guys ready? Let's jump to the next floor. Oh, <laughs> that was so close. We almost fell into the magma floor. But thankfully there was a lot and a lot of water. Well, the last floor seems to be full of very colorful beds, which I think is absolutely wonderful. I have a feeling this is where all the villagers started off, and they've now made their way quite a few floors up. But sadly, it seems like they're completely stuck here, because there's bedrock blocking the doorway. Okay, we've got to figure out what to do now, guys. We need to go ahead and warn the villagers. Wait! There's zombies everywhere! Okay, perfect! There we go! Oh, they killed us. Okay, we've got to quickly rush down there before they go ahead and attack any of the villagers. Perfect. Okay, I just needed to do that just to figure out if we could die. Okay, let's do this. So let's quickly jump down to the bottom. And perfect. Keep going. We've got to somehow use our wonderful abilities. Okay, let's eat our golden apples. And perfect. And let's do this. We're super close right now. Villagers, don't you guys worry. I'll go ahead and help you all out. Now, I can see someone right down there. And I do think I just got him. Okay, let's jump. And perfect. Let's keep on going. And good. Villagers, how are you guys doing? Thank you so much. You're doing such a good job. Okay, let's do this. Let's jump down. Okay, keep going. And perfect. Let's jump to the next floor where we've got some water. And good. And we should be able to do this. Okay, there's one right in the corner. No, we're completely out. Okay, let's use our next one. And good. I think they're right down here. Aha, uh -huh, here they are. Perfect. Good. <laughs> yes. We've done it. Guys, we've saved the villagers. This is awesome. Okay, I think we can go ahead and tell Mark the great news now. Villager, you're not going to believe it. We saved every single one of the other villagers right down there. There should not be any more evil monsters. Now, if you do want to reach them, can I recommend one thing? Going ahead and mining around this giant crater is your only choice. Just keep on mining until you pretty much go down 10 floors and you will see them all. Well guys, this has been such a crazy day. I can't believe we went ahead and saved the villagers from an evil Matrix Inception day. Which I think was pretty crazy. Well guys, I will see you soon and don't forget to like this video. Subscribe down below the button is red and don't forget to press the notifications bell. So guys, I'll see you all soon. Peace out.